Isn't it nice when you're watching a horror movie to say to yourself, oh yeah, that was pretty scary, but that'll never happen in real life? Well, I wouldn't get too comfortable, my friends, because some of the movies that we enjoy watching on the horror scope actually use human experimentation as a central theme, and it can get quite nasty. As I'm Jules, this is WhatCulture.com, and these are 10 terrifying horror movies based on human experiments. Number 10. Exam Now, sometimes you don't need a considerable setup, wide array of locations, or massive amounts of plot to keep a film engaging. An exam proves that you can base a movie in just one distinct location, allowing the narrative to move forward through the characters' interactions and still generate a tense and scary atmosphere. This movie follows eight strangers who have all turned up for an exam, as you could probably have guessed. This group is locked in a singular room and given a simple question, with the person who answers it winning a prestigious and highly sought-after corporate job. However, it doesn't take long for the scenario to become dangerous as confusion and chaos erupt. Now, while this concept doesn't make the movie sound too frightening, it certainly is. The character's complete paranoia is accentuated by the claustrophobic space, which entombs them in their irrational thinking and causes the strangers to become violent and unpredictable. This is only fueled further by the competitive aspect of their task. Now, The idea behind this experiment is fascinating, as it looks to examine how people respond when given vague instructions in a competitive environment and are just left to their own devices. As was probably expected, it devolves into anarchy. Number 9. Horrors of Malformed Men Now, There's a ton of tropes in the movie business. Often, if something has been proven to work, others will seek to put their stamp on it. And this 1969 Japanese horror flick used one such trope but brought it to life in a profoundly unique way. Horrors of Malformed Men is a scary, fascinating, and overtly theatrical movie that delves into the mad scientist cliché and shows what an insane genius is capable of with the right circumstances and levels of experimentation. Now, the movie follows a young medical student who escapes from a mental asylum and assumes a mysterious dead man's identity. He's soon lured to a strange and dangerous island led by an eccentric scientist, attempting to build an ideal society by mutating and experimenting on human test subjects. Now, The title is infamous for its exploitive nature, which doesn't just focus on heavy violence but sex and nudity as well. It's an utterly grotesque experience, filled to the brim with disgusting imagery and plot twists, but it's the experiments themselves that hold the most horror. Seeing the scientists play God and corrupt the human body beyond recognition is sure to unsettle your stomach, and it's brought to life by some horrifying practical effects. Number 8. The Belko Experiment Most of the movies on this list are pretty terrifying, but it's still easy to feel safe when watching them, thanks to the fact that there's a large degree of separation between ordinary life and these clinical experiments. However, this movie takes that comfort and throws it by the wayside, as it invades your everyday life by depicting the events of a horrifying experiment experiment completed in a high-rise office block. The Belco experiment shows a group of 80 American workers who end up locked in their office building. A mysterious voice then sounds and orders all of the building's inhabitants to kill a certain amount of people. The scared and paranoid workers reply by, well, doing just that, starting a massacre that's utterly horrible to watch. This film has often been described as office space meets battle royale, and it's easy to understand why. The film's brutal and violent nature feels entirely opposed to the safe and mundane location location, which only serves to make the movie all that more uncomfortable. Now, Without spoiling it, the final reveal gives a thought-provoking glimpse into the lengths that humanity will go to to seek answers. It's actually pretty brilliant. Number 7. The Sylvian Experiments now, there is a lot driven into this film, but one of the most pervasive parts of this flick is its focus on the paranormal and familial ties. Unlike other movies that depict strangers conducting experiments on unknown test subjects, this shows a mother performing tests on her own daughter. However, this is only the tip of the iceberg, as the film goes down a rabbit hole of convoluted plotlines and metaphysical concepts. The Sylvian experiment begins with two married neurosurgeons watching footage of a secret experiment on a selection of their children. During the experiment, a strange and unidentifiable anomaly occurs as the children begin to emit white lights. However, it's not just them watching, as their children also spot the tape. The film then shows as one of the children disappears to become part of the new experiment completed by the mother and the other sibling attempts to find her. Now, this movie's narrative is pretty weighty, as it doesn't take long to start delving into the fantastical. While it can indeed be very tough to follow, it's worth watching thanks to the grand concepts on display, tackling the afterlife, 
science, metaphysical transformations, and even immaculate conceptions. Number 6. My Little Eye So unlike other titles on this list, this film's experimental side is far less clinical and rather more social. This movie asks how far people will be willing to go for money, fame, and glory, and acts as a great critique on the dark side behind reality TV. My Little Eye tells the story of five strangers who are offered $1 million to stay in a house for six months together. The only rule is that they cannot leave. If any one of them steps out, then no one gets the money. It seems like an easy task at first, but the challenge becomes far more sinister as the stakes rise. Some horrible moments occur, and the isolated mansion's inhabitants begin to feel like they're being watched. The British horror flick feels like a perverted version of Big Brother, as it seeks to examine what can happen when strangers are forced to stick together and are put into awful scenarios. There's a far more sinister background to the experiment as well, which slowly reveals itself and takes the movie to that next level. As an audience member, you almost feel complicit in the horrifying experiment as you watch these five strangers through surveillance cameras and glimpse in on the tragedy that befalls them. Number 5. Human Experiments This 1979 horror is steeped in rich atmosphere of the B-horror movie genre. The cheap aesthetic and focus on sexually provocative images gives it an exploitive vibe that matches perfectly with the genre. Now, while it's a little rough around the edges thanks to the campy acting and dated visuals, it's a terrifying dive into what can happen if a deranged person gains control over human test subjects. The narrative follows a young country singer named Rachel, who gets charged with murder and is then sent to prison. If that wasn't bad enough, the building's resident doctor is a sadistic monster called Dr. Klein, who conducts horrifying shock therapy experiments on the inmates to air quotes cure their mental illnesses and brainwash them into becoming new people. While the movie doesn't go quite as far as the other video nasties from this period, it does present a really confronting idea about prison and experimentation. Number 4. Eyes Without a Face The love of a father towards his daughter is often a cause for beauty in the movie industry. Witnessing a man's attempts to save his only child from a life of ridicule and agony and he could have easily come out as a drama movie about their relationship. However, the means in which he tries to solve his child's problems have an all too horrifying truth that turns this movie into a nightmare. Eyes Without a Face is a French horror movie that spins the tale of a plastic surgeon whose daughter has become heavily disfigured after a car accident. To bring normality back to her life, he conducts many attempts to give her a face transplant, but unbeknownst to her, he goes to some pretty extreme and murderous lengths to get the materials required. This film was reviled upon its release thanks to the controversy of the subject matter and its exploitive nature. However, the quality of filmmaking on display is utterly breathtaking, as the visuals feel inherently clinical, reflecting the themes of experimentation and surgery. Additionally, the daughter's face mask gives her an unmistakably creepy look, as it's just so uncanny. The movie itself has a similar vibe, as everything feels real, but also lacks humanity. Number 3. Das Experiment Of all the unethical social experiments that have been completed in recent memory, the Stanford Prison Experiment created by Philip Zimbardo in 1971 is one of the most infamous. This horrifying test wasn't only shocking because of how immoral it was, but also because of the disgusting and unthinkable things that it revealed about humanity. The experiment has been brought to life on film a few times over, but none have done it better than this 2001 German horror. Das Experiment unfolds as 20 male parties participants are chosen to play guards and prisoners in a makeshift jail. The prisoners are encouraged to follow the chosen guards' rules, and the guards themselves are told to maintain order without using any physical violence. However, it only takes a few days before power starts to be abused and for prisoners to lose their grip on sanity. Now, The film isn't a direct adaptation of the Zimbardo experiment, rather it was inspired by it. However, all of the powerful lessons about authority, corruption, and how quickly an ordinary person can turn sociopathic are definitely clear. There is a horrifying find grittiness to this movie that makes it feel dirty and unstable, which fully reflects the real-life context behind it. Number 2. The Skin I Live In This Spanish-language movie takes many of the same beats as Eyes Without a Face, but just goes one step further to make it even more horrendous. It's a horror film that doesn't just try to scare you, instead it establishes an overwhelmingly uncomfortable atmosphere and fills it with damaged characters attempting to recover from their own personal traumas. The Skin I Live In shows how a once-in-a-lifetime plastic surgeon and creates a new form of synthetic skin that can withstand large amounts of damage. His human guinea pig is a young woman named Vera, who he keeps captive in his home, performing vile and unethical experiments on her. Now, Without spoiling it, the shocking ending will definitely stick with you, as the concept isn't just a gross depiction of the plastic surgeon's damaged psyche, but also a complete invasion of your comfort zone. The film is brought to life incredibly well by the performances, particularly in Antonio Banderas's captivating villain. He feels genuinely perverted and malevolent 
malevolent but suckers you in thanks to the humanity that he brings to the role. It's uncomfortable, uncompromising, and fully explores what a person with an out of whack ego can be capable of when given a subject to tinker with. And number one, Men Behind the Sun. There is hardly anything more horrifying than war atrocities, and sadly, this brutal and unrelenting movie is not only a scary film to watch, but is also one based on true events. The torture, experimentation, and horror shown in this flick are some of the most deplorable things to have ever happened to prisoners of war, and it is a genuinely tough one to sit through. Men Behind the Sun is a Hong Kong exploitation film based on the Japanese experimental atrocities conducted at the secret Unit 731 base during World War II. It details various cruel experiments committed upon Chinese and Siberian prisoner of war soldiers, which were conducted to test out the impact of biological and chemical weapons. Now, This movie is a horrendous sight, as although the visual effects are somewhat outdated, just knowing that the tests actually took place is disturbing. Some of the worst moments include bombs filled with infectious fleas, organ harvesting, strains of the bubonic plague, and more. A lot of criticism was thrown at this film thanks to its nature, and that's completely understandable. Rather than acting as a harsh but real lesson about history, it instead became a gore-fest picture that would feel at home in the genre of torture porn. However, despite its flaws, the film's context and unapologetic presentation make it a sordid and rather depressing affair. And there we go, my friends. Those were 10 terrifying horror movies based on human experiments. Well, I hope you got something out of that, my friends, and let me know what you thought about it down in the comments section below. As always, I've been Jules. You can go follow me over on Twitter at RetroJ with a zero, or you can swing by Live and Let's Dice, Dice with a C, where you can catch all of my out of work streaming. It'd be great to see you over there. Bye.